Ephraim. Your name is Eli. Eli, Eli, Yabu, Ephraim, Yabu. What is your name? Eli Nyario. Eli Chikudu. Eli Chikudu, Eli. Eli. What is your dream? Chiroto Chochi. Pastor, uh, I already see three pastors coming in my house. Pastor Kayanja, Pastor Robert Kayanja, Pastor Ben Hinn, and also Pastor Chris Okureme. Sometimes many dreams happen in my house, like sometimes I see fish coming in my house. Sometimes the cross, the cross it can come in different. What do you feel always more on your one of your feet, one of your leg? Yeah, sometimes it happens, but uh, I cannot tell. Ah, uh, chichi. You've crushed so many things in your family. You've crushed about three or four generations. One of your family head was a very important person. Fourth generation from you. Yeah, uh, I'll back up now. The family has a lot of history. Uh, our family, they have not been strong in God. There has been much witchcraft. Very, very strong witchcraft. Yeah, you managed to break that. You've managed to break even the moral compass. You've managed to break that. You are yet to break the financial situation. The dream of fish, of people of God in your house, is not as obvious as you think. It's layers. It's layers. Layers, layers, layers of God's goodness. And one of the God's goodness, he's become, he becomes sufficient. He becomes sufficient. He becomes, you become sufficient. You become a powerhouse. That's why your grandparent looked at you and gave you a name you don't usually use what is that name they called me they told me that the Mugera but I never liked that name yeah. and, and, and even Eli I've been, I've been using Elijah and and people they know me as Elijah he saw something. Though he was not serious with God, the Spirit told him that probably this one. That's why yes. the layers of anointing has come to you. This year is going to be so unique. This year is going to be so unique. You start watching from today how God is going to make things smooth and easy. Father, bless him. The Lord is anointing you. He is favoring you. And he is anointing you with more resources. In Jesus' name, you will step and you will be in the name of Jesus what nobody has been, been in the first generation. 
in the first generation the new power in your family the new authority the new money the new coffee the second generation begin to lose it the third generation could not find it the fourth generation is you you will recover it 